Am I the asshole? For embarrassing my sister's friend and making her feel unwelcome? My sister, cousin and a couple friends came over last night after work. My sister brought a friend of hers I'd only met a few times that I've never had an issue with. At one point I went to the bathroom, and the ladies were in the living room, calmly enjoying wine. When I came out, my sister's friend was in the kitchen, arguing with my son. I asked her what she was doing. She said my son went into the kitchen to get food, and she told him to wait until I came out of the bathroom to ask me for permission. I stared at her for a second and then said who the fuck are you? You don't live here. He does. Who are you to tell him he can't go in his own kitchen? She looked surprised and said she was trying to be helpful. I repeated my question of why she thought it was okay to tell someone they can't use their own kitchen when she's a guest in someone else's house. She dodged the question and then brought up that she's a teacher, which isn't even relevant, and sometimes kids try to get around rules. I asked her what that has to do with anything. I then asked who even gave her permission to go in my kitchen. She said she followed my son in. I said so you think my son needs permission to go in his own kitchen, but you can go wherever you like in my house without invitation? So you have more rights here than he does? She said she didn't feel welcome anymore and was leaving. She went back in the living room, grabbed her bag and walked out. My sister asked what happened, and I explained that she had a disagreement with my son. My cousin and some of the other ladies said they thought it was strange she followed him into the kitchen and had been wondering why she did that, and thought her motive was weird as hell. My sister and a couple other ladies said her behavior was perfectly normal and I was unnecessarily hostile to her. My cousin said but why would you confront a child you don't know instead of saying something to the aunt who's right here? That's so weird. Everyone but my sister acknowledged that part was weird, and we all moved on. Later, my sister confronted me privately and said she was upset I chased off her friend. She said she really likes this woman, and that I was way over the top in the way I spoke to her. I can be a little extra when it comes to defending my kid, so was I an asshole? Not the asshole. That friend is way out of line. She was in your house trying to boss around your son. If she was so concerned, she could have asked his aunt or, I'd knocked on the bathroom door and asked you. She has no right to parent your child. Not the asshole. It's more important for your son to feel safe and free in his house than a guest to feel welcome. Not the asshole. This lady way overstepped and you corrected her in a way that most parents would when their child is being attacked. And he was. You should sleep well knowing you did the right thing and your son will sleep better knowing his parent 100 has his back. Your sister can be upset that a confrontation happened between a friend and her sibling but her friend was way out of line. Very strange situation. Your reaction is understandable and not the asshole, of course. But man, what was she thinking, what kind of sick behavior that was? She is a teacher at school, she may adhere to some educational standards off work, no issue but she has no permission to invade people's lives in their own private space. Absolutely not the asshole. She didn't overstep the limits of acceptable behavior. She hopped, skipped, and jumped over them. Not the asshole. I've had the same reaction in similar situations at my house. Sister's ex-BF got onto my kid for not letting his own kid play in her room. I told him that my kid lives here and he doesn't, so he can put up or shut up. He left and my sister got offended. Oh well. Not the asshole. A ten-year-old is perfectly capable of sorting themselves out in their own kitchen. Her behavior was strange and way out of line. I don't think you overreacted at all op. Teacher is obviously not used to being called out on her overbearing and inappropriate behavior. Not the asshole she's one of those teachers. Not the asshole. She overstepped her boundaries then tried to defend herself but dot I'm a teacher rather than simply apologize and return to the other guests. She is probably horrible to the kids she teaches. The friend was 1000 out of line not the asshole.
Not the asshole you come upon some stranger arguing with your kid in your house over where he could go? You didn't give that entitled chud half the telling off she deserved. How that's seen as in any way appropriate for a visitor is beyond me. Lady came in and caused a ruckus, got exactly what she deserved. Info how old is your son? Not the asshole. She was way out of line and couldn't even begin to answer your questions. Not the asshole. Don't let anyone mess with your kid like that. You say it's not relevant that she's a teacher but I think that's the whole problem. I know teachers like this. They have an inborn need to control all the children. You could have left out the cussing but otherwise I'm with you on this one. Not the asshole. And she's a teacher. JFC. Not the asshole, like I get maybe asking the aunt what expectations are about some things but getting food? In their own house. No. That's a weird control thing to me. Not the asshole. Good job. Imagine having the audacity to go after some stranger's kid. Not the asshole. It always rubbed me the wrong way when people would try to call out my children on things I didn't have a problem with. You raise your kids and leave mine to me. Not the asshole and I don't understand the commenters who are saying you could have been more graceful in your delivery. Grace for a stranger who gives themselves rights in your house and tries to restrict them from your child that lives there? Fuck. That. You could have cussed her out more and you'd still be in the right. If a guest shows zero etiquette they don't get any in return, and maybe she'll think twice before pulling that at someone else's house. Not the asshole if a stranger's kid is doing something dangerous then I will step in. But eating a snack? Even if he was breaking a house rule that's none of this lady's business. And like it was mentioned, super weird she followed him to the kitchen to chastise him instead of just saying something to your sister if she had a concern. It sucks that your sister likes the woman and wants to be her friend and now it is awkward but that's not really your fault. Not the asshole for all the reasons you explained. I would not be okay with this if someone did it to my son and I've never known someone to say no kids in the kitchen other than really little kids who try to use the stove. Not the asshole. While your response was aggressive, I think it was warranted due to the entitlement shown here by that woman. Not the asshole. Though you could have certainly handled it with more grace. Immediate aggression and swearing at her seemed a little over the top, but I'm guessing you were caught off guard and reacted in the moment. But she was being completely inappropriate, so I stand by the not the asshole. Not the asshole. Your sister's friend is T.A. Lamau, not the asshole, op. If she hadn't voluntarily left, I would kicked her out myself. Not the asshole on any level not her house so not her business. Your sister sounds needy. Not the asshole and you didn't overreact. Not the asshole. For all the reasons already mentioned. Why would she think she had any right to deny anyone anything in your house?